What does trance mean to you? Trance to me means the ability to affect emotions, to be taken on a journey, to be happy or sad, hypnotic, uplifting, melancholic, just taking on a journey, a journey. Well, it's about to end and you are organizing the last ever party. Which DJs would you book to play? If the world was about to end and I was organizing the party, then I would play um, because it's the last time. I would hear myself play. But also, I'd like to hear Adam Bear, Carl Cox, Maceo Plex, Anna, Umek, Techno, and Asterix. What is your greatest fear? My greatest fear is definitely dying, for sure. What is your earliest memory? My earliest memory is being with my grandmother, cutting my knee in the park, and with my grandfather as well. I'm looking after him. Have you ever said, I love you, and not mean it? I have never said I love you and never meant it, no. What is your guiltiest pleasure? My guiltiest pleasure is sweets, Haribos, Haribo cola bottles, Haribo fizzy cola bottles, anything sour, cheesecake, chocolate, ice cream, frozen yogurt, just everything bad. What's your all-time favorite movie? My all-time favorite movie changes, but it is anything with Denzel, probably Man on Fire. If you could change one thing about the world, what would you change? If I could change one thing about the world, I would change COVID at this current time, poverty and hatred. What is the most important lesson life has taught you? The most important lesson life has taught me is always changing, but I guess in times like this where it's very hard to see the light at the end of the tunnel, it's just to keep strong and keep fighting and keep pushing because it will get better. In a film about your life, who would play you? In a film about my life, then some Washington would play me, you know what I'm saying? You're only allowed one alcoholic drink for the rest of your life. What do you choose? If I'm only allowed one alcoholic drink, I would choose pina colada. It used to be frozen strawberry or mango daiquiri, but that's going to be the change of the pina colada. Though. If you were an animal, what would you be? If I was an animal, I would be a lion king of the jungle top of the food chain. Which track from your back catalogue best defines you and your sound? The track from my back catalogue that best defines my sound is probably Smack of Thumb. When did you last cry and why? Uh, I last cried, can't remember when, but I am emotional so I can cry a lot. Um, but yeah, probably crying more inside. Not if you weren't a DJ or producer, what would you be? If I wasn't a DJ or producer, I wouldn't be a footballer or too old for that. Or I wouldn't mind getting back into the A&R role, um, looking after bands, um, signing new artists. I think that could be good for me. That's what I first did when I first got into the industry. So going back to that would probably be what I would do. What is your favorite country to travel in? My favorite country to travel in is definitely Thailand. Top three trance tracks of all time? My top three trance tracks of all time are Sasha Expander, Plastic Boy Silver Bath, and something by Asterix like Poison or. It would be tough, but it changes. We just go for Poison Asterix. What is the one thing coming up in your schedule that you are most excited about? One thing I'm most excited about coming up on my schedule is seven compilation which is out at the end of October um, doing a remix for Asterix at the moment and working on a lot of stuff trying to change my sound for something a little bit different uh, a club, uh, project with Greg Darley so a lot of things on the go A final message for the dedicated trans fans on the trans portal My final message would be stay safe guys looking forward to seeing you again soon hopefully soon um, times are difficult and yeah, we're going to stay strong and thanks for all the support this year.